all you guys out there saying go do a snakehead video. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? All right, folks, welcome to That's Fishing with Captain Shane. I'm out here in world famous Markham Park fishing with Chris Albert, my buddy. What's up, Chris? Hey, how's it going? We, uh, we've already been fishing a little bit. We've caught some nice snakeheads. You guys have been, uh, a lot of guys have been asking me, you know, how about a snakehead video? How about a snakehead video? Well, today's your day. Stay tuned. We got snakeheads, all right? Got one. Uh oh. That's what you call perfect timing. <laughs> perfect timing, Chris. That was not planned. That was on a what? A, bu a, 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 a buzz or something. <laughs> tell them what it is, Chris. I couldn't tell you. Chris can't tell you. In the package. It looks like a, a grass burner or something like that. Anyway, stay tuned. It's going to be cool. Oh. So anyway, we're fishing for the most controversial fish in the United States. I tell you what, if you want to start an argument between two friends, just mention snakeheads. You know, they're either going to say kill them all or release them all. Either way, it's a, it's a non-winning situation. You're going to see me release every one of them today. And um, I was probably one of the first ones on camera to start releasing them. But the government says, hey, man, you can't transport a live one. And that's really the only stipulation. So, you know, if you release them back in the same body of water you caught them in, you're okay. But anyway, your comments will be much appreciated. I'll answer them. And even if you disagree with me, I'll answer them. What do you think, Chris? Kill them I, all or release them? I think they're here to stay, so you might as well release them. That is the thing. They're not going nowhere. The government's been shocking these fish here for about seven years that I know of, maybe even longer. And you see, we've already put six or seven in the boat today. So, and they shock this canal system regularly. Now, we're not getting the big ones, and that's in part due to the, some of the snakehead kill tournaments and uh, and then, of course, the uh, FWC shock programs. But I know they got snakeheads everywhere, man. I know Baltimore, uh, Maryland, or the Potomac, Delaware, all those. You guys got monsters up there. You got your own set of issues up there. I know a lot of you guys are, are probably arguing about that uh, in amongst each other. And but um, over in Thailand, man, they don't have no problem. They ain't releasing none of them over there. <laughs> I guarantee you they're eating them all. But anyway, um, I appreciate you guys watching, man. And, uh, you guys have been clamoring for a snakehead video. Not everybody, but I have a lot of foreign subscribers. And they want to see more of these snakeheads. So here we go, snakeheads. Uh-oh. Oh, he got off. He got off. <laughs> oh, man. It's... Here he goes. Here we go. Ugh, got him. I saw him coming. Oh, and he got off. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. I'm 0 for 3. Holy crap. Oh, Chris, there was one there. Same, I wonder if it was a pair. First snakehead of the day, and he is spinning like a snakehead. Yeah, towed on himself. Oh, try to get in the trolling motor. You're okay, Chris. You're okay. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. yes. For all you guys out there saying go do a snakehead video, are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Two folks, number two. But we missed three before that one. Anyway. And some blow ups that they completely Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't really yeah, we I mean yeah, of course we didn't miss them, the fish missed them. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. 
Dang! Oh, that was that was on me. I don't know, man. That sure didn't feel like it. A... Oh God! It's coming! <laughs> Oh, it probably was. Oh my god. Oh! oh that's god. a good that's a good one right there now. Well I say it's a good one, it's a heck of a hit. Oh man. Oh, he's got about 50 pounds of grass on him. That's why you go with heavy braid and a stout hook, man, right there. Keep rocking and rolling, Chris. There might be more. Oh yes, there is justice in this world. Chris, this is how you want to... I'm going to show you how to get these snakeheads though. <laughs> okay, see, see that? <laughs> okay, I'm a little rusty, but there's, there's like a... There's like a the chin, the jowl is what I call it. Like you would get a grouper, that's where you want to get them. Get them just like that, under that jowl, under that part right oh, there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. You see that drop back? This is a product. Now this this is this is how come I know the FWC uh, electroshock system is working. And one of the reasons I don't run snakehead charters anymore, or most of your fish are like this. They've they've done taking out most of your breeders in these big canal systems. You can still get them in the little canal systems in the industrial parks and stuff like that where they can't get their boats in. But for the most part, this is what we've been reduced to. But uh, anyway, still a lot of fun. Holy moly. We'll get bigger. Yeah, nothing, nothing in the water. Right, no nothing to stabilize or, or steer back there. This thing's full of spiders, man. I have freaked out more customers going through these tubes. And under, oh my goodness, man. Spiders like you wouldn't believe, dude. Uh, you crawl all, all over you, man. Oh, yeah, man. Be crawling all over the boat, crawling down your back. Yeah, that, 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 that would freak me out a little bit. Yeah. I got these spiders right there. All right, guys, we're looking for one more fish. We're looking for a giant explosion, and then we're out of here. This weather's turning to crap. It's a little calm right now. I think this is the calm before the storm. Stay tuned. One more fish. We can do it. You can do it, Chris. Let's do it. One of us is going to do it. Oh, whoa. Ah! He ain't no big one, but I got him. I got it. That ain't even a... Oh, yeah. Everywhere I go, everywhere I go, largemouth seem to find me. I will take him. Caught him on the gambler big easy. Can't go wrong with a gambler big easy. Caught my personal best largemouth on that gambler big easy right there. Almost 11 pounds on Okeechobee. Chris, I'm talking to you. Not, not the audience at home. Pay attention, Chris. Follow the script. I'm a lot <laughs> oh, man. Get out of here.
Still not him. Put up much of a fight, though. I'm kind of disappointed in it, to be honest <laughs> with you. I am disappointed in you, partner. Mm hmm. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, there he is, Chris. Yeah, Chris. You got him, Chris? Oh, yeah. Tell you what, this is some of the best snakehead fishing I've done in a long time, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I just, I mean, just for sure, sure numbers of fish, man. Yeah, Good job, brother. Good. Yeah. All right, guys, you asked for it, you got it. Snakehead video, it's in the can. Uh, Chris, always a pleasure to have you aboard. It's always a pleasure to be on board. Like I said, you've seen Chris in a couple of videos of mine, and um, he's going down to the Amazon to fish peacock bass with me. If you guys want to go fish a peacock in the Amazon, Give me a call November 11th through the 18th. But anyway, you guys kept asking about snakehead videos. Not everybody, but certain people. And uh, I was pleasantly surprised to come out here and we banged out at least eight, maybe nine or ten. I'm not really sure. Yeah, somewhere around there. Maybe a few more. And we, and we whiffed on a lot of them. And uh, I tried to do a couple of those TV hook sets and I actually cost myself a few fish as well. But anyway, it was a good time. I appreciate you guys watching. I thank you for your subscription. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Um, and leave a comment. If you leave a comment, I promise you I'll get back to you, okay? I promise I'll answer your comments. But anyway, I thank you guys, and I appreciate it. All right? Captain Shane out. Thanks, Chris.